Hey there, Vineyard folk. You know, I'm teaching from a text from the book of Mark this weekend that always makes me pause. In chapter 10, it says that there's a couple of the disciples that were asking Jesus if they could have the seats of honor with him when he took his throne, the left and the right. And Jesus took that opportunity and he lays out this new kingdom truth for them. And he says, you know, that those, are, that those who are regarded as rulers among the Gentiles, they lord it over them, and their high officials exercise authority over them, but not so with you. Instead, whoever wants to become great among you must be your servant, and whoever wants to be first among you must be a slave of all. That phrase, not so with you, just kind of lays there. I mean, it's really heavy. I've been around the church and church people most of my life. I've met some really good people, some gifted people, some godly people, strong leaders, great leaders. And I still struggle some with what that passage implies because this isn't some nicely packaged corporate leadership model. I mean, it's completely counterintuitive, completely countercultural, and we all understand how power works. I mean, someone has the power and you do it their way. I mean, that's the way we know it, but not so with you. In this upside down kingdom, if you desire influence, you exercise it from underneath and not from above. You demonstrate power under, not power over. You serve, you raise people up, you give preference to others, it's crazy. And it challenges me greatly. I want to talk more about this, how we live this out in a practical way this Sunday. So come this Sunday, it's gonna be good. I love you, I'm praying for you. And I'll see you then.